Hi guys and welcome back to another uh, beginners tutorial for Unreal Engine 5. So today I'm going to be showing you how to import assets from Quixel Megascans so you can create scenes like you see in front of you. So all these rocks, um, they're basically imported straight out of Quixel Megascans. Uh, so let's have a look at it get them in. So you see this box with a green plus symbol on it up here. Click that, and then you'll go to, to Quixel Megabridge. Now it may ask you to install the software, so just install it, it's completely free. Open it up and you should get this screen. So say for example, you wanted to make a scene like this tundra here. You'd click into it, and underneath you've got all the different meshes and the different assets and the different services that would make up that scene. So obviously you can get this from these. Yeah, you follow? So if I said, okay, let's download this folder here. Okay, so I click into it. And then you've got the export settings down here. So I can export in low, medium, high, and nanite quality. Obviously the size differs depending on how big um, or small the export is. So this would obviously be a low sized file and this would obviously be a high sized file. So once that's downloading, uh, or to download, hit this green button here, come up to home, local, and this is where all your downloads will be. And to export it, you simply click on it and hit the plus button here. Now, if you have an Unreal Engine um, project open, this is going to show you what it's importing. So this is the sandstone and the various different height maps and textures. I follow that. So I click X here. So this is now already added into our scene. X here, bring this down. I go to my content draw. And now you can see a file called Megascan. So I've already got a lot in this project already. So Megascans folder will be added. And then, for example, if you've just downloaded a boulder, it will come under 3D assets. So in this one, I've downloaded one called Huge Canyon Sandstone. It won't fit this scene, but just for all intensive purposes, let's drag him on. Yeah. And there he is. And it really, really is as simple as that. You can just run away with your imagination here and do whatever you want with this. Obviously, this one doesn't fit this uh, sort of viking scenario norwegian scene i've kind of going on here but you can see what you can build with this i've got another video where i show you how to create a canon a canon a canyon a canyon type uh scene with all the assets that like uh, like i've just dragged on the screen there and each individual one is its own mesh so you can see if I take that away, remove it, take it away, drag that up there, and you can bring them across. You can swivel them around to just create a little bit of uh, variety in your scenes. So that's basically it. That's how you import um, meshes from Quixel Bridge. And inside Quixel Bridge, you've got uh, 16,692 different components that you can add into your scenes from buildings to plants to wood to grass anything all different types of surfaces that you can add on to your landscape floor which i've gone over in another tutorial uh, be sure to check that one out because if you've just created a landscape and you want to get um a sort of uh but a textured surface so you can put this on it for example a rock cliff textured surface so be sure to check that out and that's basically it that's it's as easy as that all completely free and you can create environments like this or absolutely nothing okay uh, be sure to uh subscribe if you can i'm, I'm fairly new to um youtube and and making videos so i appreciate all the all the help Thanks, guys.